welcome back to my channel. I'm Des. And sa video na to, itatry kong gumawa ng Dalgona Coffee, which is the most popular coffee recipe as of the moment. So, if you are interested to know kung paano gumawa ng Dalgona Coffee and kung bakit ako gagawa ng Dalgona Coffee, then please keep on watching. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing. So guys, it's March 26 and it is day 10 of the Enhanced Community Quarantine. And I'm sure lahat tayo bagot na bagot na sa bahay. Pero alam niyo yun, kapit lang. Let's find new things to do. In my case, ang naisip ko is mag-dive into the TikTok recipes na sobrang famous ngayon. And naisip ko ang gawin yung Dalgona Coffee because I love coffee. And naisip ko rin gawin to as a treat for my sister who is a healthcare worker. Alam naman natin yung role ng mga healthcare workers sa panahon ngayon, di ba? Sila yung nasa front line sa pakikipagdigma or pakikipaglaban sa COVID-19. So, naisip ko gawan yung sister ko ng Dalgona Coffee para, alam yun, to show my appreciation to her and as a treat na rin for her. Kasi bukas, duty na naman siya and ilang araw ko na naman siyang hindi makikita. So, simulan na natin ng ating paggawa ng Dalgona Coffee by introducing the ingredients. May introduction ng ingredients, Besh. Okay. So, yung first na kailangan natin is coffee, obviously. I got this one, yung maliit na pack lang. But, of course, you can choose any brand that you want. Apart from coffee, meron din akong chocolate powdered milk. My sister likes this brand. Galing to sa kanyang baunan. Ninakaw ko lang. And sabi ko, why not try to do a whisked version of this? Baka okay din. Next, you will need sugar. Yung sugar namin ay washed. Merong mga sugar na brown, may muscovado, merong refined na kulay white. Any of those, pwede nyo namang gamitin. Walang problema dun. Next, you will also need milk. Bahala na kayo kung anong klaseng milk yung gusto nyo. This one is full cream milk. Pero nakikita ko rin naman yung iba na gumagamit ng almond milk, ng soy milk, or kung anong milk yung trip nyo. Another ingredient would be hot water. Pero wala ngayon dito because tinabi ko muna para iwas aksidente. But... Later on, ilalabas ko na lang siya. Meron pa tayong final ingredient and that is ice. Pero hindi ko muna nilabas para hindi matunaw sa init ng panahon ngayon. Later ko na lang siya ilalabas kapag gagamitin ko na siya. So now let's proceed first by making the coffee version. Meron lang ako ditong dalawang lalagyan. Yung isa muna yung gagamitin ko for the coffee version. And dito natin ilalagay yung ingredients because dito natin siya i-whisk. So, first, kunin muna natin yung coffee. Ayan, ginupit ko na siya. And then, meron ako dito ang measuring spoon. For me, okay na ako sa 1 tablespoon. And then, ngayon naman, maglagay na tayo ng sugar. So, dahil gusto ko na medyo matamis yung coffee ko, I'll place 1 and a half tablespoons. So now we are ready to add in the hot water. For now, one tablespoon muna yung nilagay ko. And then yung next step is gumamit ng whisk. Yung iba gumagamit ng tinidor. Yung iba gumagamit ng manual na whisk. Pero dahil wala kami nung manual na whisk, ito lang yung meron kami, hand mixer. Ito na lang yung gagamitin ko. So, i-whisk lang natin siya until maging fluffy yung consistency niya. Do that again. So, ngayon, ito na yung consistency niya. Medyo mas malapot na siya. Oh my gosh! It looks like caramel. Parang ganun. Hindi, nakakatakam. Pero, try ko pang i-whisk ng medyo mas matagal pa. 
baka mas maging fluffy pa siya. Ayan. Oh my gosh. Sobrang ano na niya. Sobrang lapot na. I feel like okay na tong consistency na to. I'll just let it sit for a while habang ginagawa ko yung chocolate version. Ayan. So, andito na ako ulit and gawin na natin yung second version which is the Dolgona chocolate. Hindi ko alam kung tama yung term na inimbento ko pero for the sake of this video, yun na lang yung itawag natin sa second recipe na ito. So, first maglagay tayo of course nung ating chocolate powder drink. Inubos ko yung isang pack mga dish. Ang ganda ni Liza. Nakakainis. Mm. Maglagay naman tayo ngayon ng sugar. Sobrang runny niya. Nasobrahan ko yata yung tubig dish. Paano na? I-try ko pang habaan yung pag whisk Pinodo ko na yung power ng aming mixer, pero I guess hanggang dito na lang siya. Ayan, so I have here the two mixtures. Ito yung coffee and ito yung chocolate natin. And now it's time na ilagay natin sila sa container. So kanina nabanggit ko na kailangan natin ng ice. Nilagay ko na yung ice dito sa ating goblets. Ayan. The next thing to do is lagyan natin ng milk. Hindi siya kailangang mapuno, guys. Yan. So, ayan na siya. And then, tsaka natin ilalagay sa taas. Parang toppings, ganun, yung ating ginawang fluffy mixture. So, let's start with the coffee. It's so fluffy! I think important na merong ice para merong maghuhold dun sa fluffy mixture natin. Tapos, ispread lang natin para cute siya tingnan sa baso. And then, ngayon naman, ilagay na natin yung ating chocolate drink. Thank you. So, there you go, guys. Ito na yung ating finished product. So ngayon naman guys, tawagin na natin yung aking sister para matikman na namin itong ginawa kong recipes. Ito yung Dalgona Coffee and this one is the Dalgona Chocolate. Sister, come on, come on. Ayan, everyone, this is my sister Megan. Isa siyang OR nurse. And isa siya sa mga essential workers ngayong merong COVID-19 pandemic. And this is my treat for her. Kanya yung chocolate. Sa akin yung coffee. So, yan. Try na natin. Pwede mo siyang haluin. Kasi para siyang iced coffee. Sa kanya, iced chocolate. So, pag naghalo na yung milk and yung coffee, Yun na. Diba? It's a perfect recipe for summer, lalo na ngayong mainit. And of course, lahat tayo nabubor. Pwede mo siyang gawin. Or if you want to thank someone, diba? It's a treat na pwede mong gawin para sa kanila. Mmm! Meron talaga siyang texture. Kahit na nahalo na siya dun sa milk, 
ang frothy pa rin nung, ano, nung texture niya. And masarap siya. Ayan, okay na. Ang bilis ang hubos. <laughs> Grabe. So, ayun guys. We have reached the end of this video and sana nag-enjoy kayo. And masaya ako na na-enjoy niya yung ginawa ko. And I suggest na kung meron kayong kakilalang healthcare worker, this is one way to show your appreciation for them. You know that? I appreciate you. I'm Thank so you. proud of you. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go, guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you did enjoy, then please don't forget to hit the like button, leave a comment below, and subscribe to my channel. And dito ka na rin lang, i-press mo na yung subscribe button and yung bell button beside it. Thank you for watching guys, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye! Bye.